integers. Integers are positive and negative numbers. If I told you that I was walking to school and I found $5, where on this number line would I graph $5, finding $5? It would be right here at a positive 5. Likewise, if I told you I was walking to school and I lost $5, I would put it down here at negative 5 because I lost $5. Integers is just the vocabulary. It means a positive or negative number. By definition, an integer is a whole number or its opposite. For example, 5 and negative 5 are opposites. Finding $5, losing $5. 3 and negative 3 are opposites. It's interesting to note that opposites are the same distance from 0. 3 spaces here, 3 spaces here. Also, the positive numbers are to the right of 0. The negative numbers are to the left of 0. You can also show integers on a vertical number line. If I told you that it was 20 degrees outside, that would be a positive 20. If I said, oh, it's going to be very cold when we snow ski, it will be negative 10 or 10 degrees below 0, that would be a negative 10. The positive numbers are above 0, the negative numbers are below 0. To change words into integers, remember positive or negative numbers, Simply look for keywords such as gain, loss, above, or below. For example, a gain of 10 yards in football would be a positive 10. 6 feet above sea level would be a positive 6 as an integer. Earning $20 would be positive 20. For negative numbers, you want to look for loss, decrease, below, for example, a loss of $5 in football would be a negative 5. Spending $25, the integer for that, the number for that would be negative 25. The integer representing 12 degrees below freezing is negative 12. So look for the number, but also look for the keyword that tells you whether it's positive or negative. Bank accounts are an interesting thing. Deposits. Now think about it, when you put money into the bank, your bank account goes up. So if I make a deposit of $25, the integer I'm talking about is a positive 25. If I make a withdrawal of $30, my bank account will go down. So a withdrawal of $30 would be a negative 30. So let's give it a try. So to write the integer, remember the positive or negative number, represented and underline the key word. The temperature is 10 degrees below zero, so negative 10. I found a dollar on the way to school. Found is a positive, so positive one. The football team lost seven yards on the first play, negative seven. I earned $15 babysitting. That's positive 15. I made a deposit of $14. So remember, your bank account will go up here, so positive 14. I made a withdrawal, so your bank account's going down, of 22, so negative 22.